We need to talk about the sinking ship that is the San Francisco Giants. The Giants took two torpedoes into the hull last night, and, and they're sinking. Things are not good. Uh, a brutal loss in a game at Wrigley Field where the Giants led by multiple runs, multiple times, and they lose. Like, that's devastating to a baseball team that is trying to break a losing streak. Uh, the Giants had scored one run in their previous three games, losing all of them, riding a four-game losing streak into a game where they're putting up crooked numbers, they score eight runs, and still lose. Like, that hurts. Like, they're only humans, right? Like, that, that that'll keep you up at night as a baseball player when you get... You know, shut out in two of your last three games with one run in the other game. You go out and get eight runs and crooked numbers galore, and you still lose. That's five in a row. That's five in a row. And if the Giants, who are underway, by the way, at Wrigley Field right now, if the Giants lose today, that's a 0 and 6 road trip. It's the wrong time of the year to be having an 0-6 road trip. You do that back in May if you're going to do it at all. Okay, it's the wrong time of the year for an 0-6 road trip. How do things get worse? Well, let me tell you that Patrick Bailey is on the concussion list. So one of the best rook, the best rookie on the team, one of the best players on the team is unavailable right now. And you know, again, here's the deal. It, it's it's win today and you're one and five on a six gamer. You lose, you get a date with Broom Hilda, and she's gonna fly with you back to San Francisco after this road trip. Not good. Not good. Gabe Kapler and Farhan Zaidi should send the 49ers front office a muffin basket. Because the 49ers constant drama surrounding their roster is the only thing keeping the heat off of Farhan, who just had the worst trade deadline in maybe the history of the Giants front office with A.J. Pollock and nothing else, folks. And the team has been taking on water and dying since August 1st. Dying, like dead last in every major league offensive category that counts. That's who the Giants have been since August.